We are back, ladies and gentlemen. It is the second day of me playing Resident Evil 2 Remake. Unfortunately, today I did not get a chance to play it on a main stream. Tonight we're playing it for a couple hours at night. Welcome back. This is the hardcore run. And we're continuing on right where we left off last night. We just fought that giant... What the fuck? That is creepy. You could hear them chanting in the forest. That is some creepy shit, dude. That is real creepy. But luckily they're not out there. Anyway, we just killed the giant whatever it was in the lake. And uh, and now we are going to investigate these woods past the boathouse. Creepy. Creepy. <laughs> Doesn't really look like there's a right or a wrong way to go through here. The light is crazy, though. Some Blair Witch shit going on. Ooh, I got a red herb, baby. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, shit. No, even that. I think I should make some ammo. Let's see what I can make. Oh, I can make everything. Wow, I should make shotgun shells. I have very few shotgun shells, right? So I should probably do that. Maybe I'll make some submachine gun ammo as well. Let's do some shotgun shells. Cool. Turn the audio up a bit. You think so? You got tell me you guys tell me if you want me to up the volume, okay? Let me know. Right now, I think it's purposely, like, whisper level because they're trying to creep you out with these guys chanting. That is creepy. What are they saying? It's Spanish. I'm trying to understand it, but... Oh, boy. No, I, I've seen two of the John Wick movies. The first two. I did not see the others. Oh, man, we're sneaking up on them. You can hear they're getting louder, dude. Hear that? Oh, no. Wow, this thing doesn't work. Well, I'm about to die. It doesn't work. The, the bolts don't work on this guy. I didn't know that. That really sucks. I guess we're going to have to use the shotgun. I had full health. I just used my healing item. I had full health and it insta-killed me. I guess in hardcore mode it can insta-kill you regardless. doesn't die what am I supposed to do it doesn't even flinch that's completely different from the original game it doesn't even flinch uh I guess I'm gonna shoot it in the legs right either that or I'm just gonna absolutely fill it with TMP ammo it's one or the other like holy shit dude Okay, what a start to tonight, huh? Oh, please, it's TM. You gotta use TMP. I filled it with TMP and it died. Shit! 
Yeah, that's exactly what you need to do. It's TMP. The TMP fucking hits it from all directions. Why don't you just load the fucking thing? It won't... What? It won't load into the weapon? But I've done this before. I've loaded it into the weapon before. This doesn't make any sense. Why is it doing this to me now? It never did this before. Well, I guess we'll make more TMP ammo then. Right? That makes no sense because I've done this before where I've combined the ammo to the gun. And this time I wouldn't do it. Huh. Oh, this is some creepy shit. Those things are nuts in this one. And you know there's going to be millions more later. I've got to sell the snake. You're right. I have to sell one for a mission. And the other one I'm saving is a healing item. You're absolutely right. I need to sell them. i got to get back to the merchant first. What we're trying to do. Well, Cinnamon Rifle Bun just did a super chat saying, I'm enjoying watching you during Ramadan. Uh, screw the haters. Keep on doing you. Thank you very much. The Cinnamon R Rifle Bun. And you are actually the first uh, time you've ever super chatted here. Thank you so much. Cetas and gunpowder. Bats. Oh, I can't see shit in here. The lighting makes it extra creepy. What is this place? Good question. Some kind of shrine. The shrine of the Silver Monkey. By the way, this whole part is new, no? I don't remember this at all from the original game. I think this whole entire part is new. Same mark from the church. Hmm. I don't have this. This must be a side quest. You must have to get two optional items to place here. And then you can come back and solve a puzzle. So, I don't know. Right now... Is this the key? Looks like you can't take it, right? You need to have other items first. And you put them in there and then we'll come... So we have to come back for this later. This is brand new. Oh, I love the game so far, Jeremy. Add the gamer says, Mods, stop timing me out for no reason. Mods, don't time them out for no reason. If there's a good reason, then time them out. I don't know why you're timing them out, so... Okay. What the hell? It's the lake. With the monster drawn onto the picture of the lake. Wait, what? Oh, look! There's treasures in the middle of the lake. There's also treasures over here. Look at this. This is all new. Interesting. Very interesting. So when we get to this boat, we'll either be able to go over here or back to the merchant, or we can go out back to the lake, and we can check this area out. All right, there's a lot to do. Oh, this is very interesting. All right, I've not affected Leon's hair. What we set yesterday is uh, is what we left on. It's all exactly the same as yesterday. I've affected. I've changed nothing. What the hell is this? <laughs> Why is it just sitting here? Look. The old way shrine key. Can I open all those way shrines we found up to now with this key? Maybe we found a few of them, but I don't know what's, what would be in them because those are new. Here's also a new side quest. Someone fetched me a rare golden chicken egg. Okay, we haven't found one yet in the game. They were rare drops in the original game, just completely random. So I guess if we ever find one, we bring it to the merchant. Okay, well, so we had left. Is that not the merchant? It is. So we should head over there. We should trade in the snake and sell other shit, right? Then we should go back out to the lake if we can. And we should investigate this area. We should investigate this area and this area and see what all those are, right? I don't know what this is or how to get there. 
And then we should investigate down here. Like, we have a lot to do here in this lake. Exactly, she had. Like, if you see this this area right now, like, this is different. Yes, there was the boat stuff, but this is new stuff they've added. This is pretty neat. Go to the vendor. Oh, nice. I got the setos right there. There you go. Trade in some stuff. Took care of her a quest, did ya? Well, look at you. So there you go. I got four spinels for that. And then, if I sell you. this viper, that's this another quest completed. Yep, and that's another Fine. four spinels. A job well done deserves payment in. And then I could well, sell this, and I could sell the velvet blue. Yep. Your valuables won't do a deal well struck. Now I have twelve spinels, and look at all the new stuff they added. Holy crap! Look at this. Man, we could upgrade the case again, which I sh totally should do right away. But I want this laser sight. God damn it. Nah, I think it's more important. I think it's way more important right now to get the the upgrade, the inventory upgrade. So we're gonna do that. Visby, there's tons of major changes from the original. Watch my podcast from this morning, the Level 1 podcast. I talked about all of them, okay? So I can change my attach A case by, by customize... What? I go to the typewriter to do that, I guess? All right. <laughs> you can't go wrong with that. Red barrels are four. A yellow diamond is three. A yellow herb is three. I think I'm just going to save it. I'm not going to... I'm not going to do anything right now. Yeah. I don't think I'm going to... I'm going to save oh, my spinels for further upgrades. killing me. The TMP stock? Oh, been kind to us. shit, I should have... Oh, no, that's all right. Okay, so I need to repair my knife for sure. Give that the there you go. Deserves, mate. It's not an inventory upgrade? What? It's a cosmetic that gives you a special effect. you got to be fucking kidding me. Oh. It's not an inventory upgrade to upgrade your case in this one. Oh, come on! Oh! This was the case upgrade! Oh! Fuck this. Uncom Nobody fucks me. Welcome. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. There you Thank go. You. <laughs> Nobody fucks me. There we go. All right. I got the I got the fucking upgrade, which is what I wanted. But now I got a fucking stupid case skin. Let's before we even do anything else, let's see what the stupid case skin is that I got. Right? Customize your stupid case. So here it is. Increase drop rate for handgun ammo. Increase drop rate for, for resources L. Change case. So I have increased drop rate for large resources. Okay. And then this. 20% shotgun shell. Increased capacity bullshit. God damn this. This sucks ass, man. <laughs> what shit? Oh. What complete shit. Well, the good news is I did get inventory upgrade increased, as you can see. I did buy it. Very upset, if you can't tell. So now, can I even tune up anything? Because I have no money again, right? I've got something new for you, mate. Can I, can I tune up any... Uh, let's see. I can upgrade the power of the knife. I don't really think that's going to affect me in a positive way. Knife needs care every once in a while. Uh, Could be... I still use the handgun. I did upgrade. Oh, you know what I should upgrade? Can I upgrade the TMP at all? Yeah, 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 yeah. Lack of skill. Let's do. Let's upgrade the TMP power. Okay. This kind of work is about finesse. Come back. All right. There you go. So it does up, it upgrade upgrade the drop rate of uh, large resources, and the large resource things are let you let you craft the better ammo in the game. So it's useful. It's just. Not as useful as what I fucking just spent on it. Seriously, there's no way it was worth that. So anyway, thank you to Cinnamon Rifle Bun. You are the 
Last super chatter. I want to get you up on the leaderboard. Sorry I didn't do it earlier. Um, and then Guts just re-upped his membership for four months. It says, whatever happened to the original voice actor of Leon? That's a good question. I have no clue. I don't know who that was, so I can't answer. But thank you for the uh, continuous support of the channel. Okay, so now I think what we should do is we should go investigate. Um, we should go investigate those new areas in the lake and see what we can find. Because this is new stuff. Investigating this lake is pretty neat. I'm excited to check it out. So. This looks like a dead end, like, but maybe not? Eh, I don't know. Let's, before we do this, because this is saying that this is where we need to go for this story, let's go back out to the main lake and let's see what we can find. It looks like there's a bunch of optional stuff. Let's go out to the lake. Oh, shit. <laughs> These fucking stalactites. That's where we just came from. So now I'm getting an adaptive trigger feedback right now. As I try to drive here, it's actually real, feeling really weird. Like there's a, like there's a give to the trigger. Now, did, were we here already? Is this where we were earlier? Is this where we were earlier and we didn't have the boat? It is, isn't it? Man, that rain is something else. Uh, hmm. Now, we couldn't do this because it was a stone pedestal and we didn't have the answer, right? We didn't have the thing to do it, so we still don't have it. So we can't do this. So this is no good. We head out to the center. See that? The Lakeside Settlement. Have we been to the Lakeside Settlement? No, right? Have we? Lakeside Settlement. I guess we can check it out. There's a lot of stuff there, including a door with insignia. We now have the insignia key. Uh, we can check that out. But over here, obviously we want to go to the center, and there's another area here. Apparently there's a way to go over there, but I don't know how. Hmm. Thank you to Pays420, who just became a member tonight. Thank you so much, Pays, for the channel support. And uh, that gets us to 427 members. We're trying to hit 430 tonight to make up for the few that we lost overnight from last night. Last night we had 430. We, we get back there tonight. Okay, thank you, Pays. And uh, I guess what we'll do is let's check out the center of the lake, which seems to be dead ahead. See this? Not a boat. Uh, oh, first of all, it's an item. I can set that. How do I dock here? There's another item. get up on this boat. There's got to be a way. Um, you can't just climb. I mean, why not? It's right there, dude. Just grab the fucking edge. The game won't let you. So let me guess. There's a puzzle to this, and I don't know what it is yet. I don't know how to do it. Oh, whoa, whoa, right there, right there, right there. Okay. It is dark as shit. Alexandrite. That is a brand new kind of gem. It says there's another treasure behind me. Oh, shit. A new handgun. Isn't that essentially a Luger? The, the uh, Red 5, powerful handgun, a large Red 9, is burned into the grip to prevent the user from loading incorrect ammo. The Red 9, I wonder how good it is in this one. I don't know, but that was a good find, right? Just don't know if it's any good. The thing is, we already have the Punisher, right? So I don't really know if it's good. It's the most powerful handgun in the game, is it? All right. Put that sucker down there then. Maybe we don't want the Punisher anymore then. Maybe we get rid of it. 
All right, cool. Okay, now, over here on the shore, I believe that's straight ahead. Yeah, uh, no, to the left. There's something over here on the map. See it? For the treasure. So maybe there's a way in. Right there, is it? No. It's over here. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Chickens! Hello. Hello, chickens. How you doing? Is it Chicken Island? A little chicken place. I'm not here to hurt you. I'm just here to chill. See what you're up to. Get me some chicken eggs. Thing is, I don't need any chicken eggs right now, right? Like, I'm good on health. Yeah. We're, we got a golden chicken egg. That's for the quest. But I think it's random that they would lay one, right? I don't think that actually it's... it's. Well, in the original Resident Evil 4, it was random. Maybe in this one, it's not. Maybe in this one, there's only one place you can get it. Right now, I see brown. And I see regular. So basically, if I ever need heal... Oh my god, I found it! I just found it. Perfect. The Red 9 is a Chinese Mauser, I'm being told. Okay, that's the type of pistol. Well, we just turned it... We just got a quest we could turn in. That's excellent. All right, thank you all for the eggs. If I ever need health, I'll come back here. So is this essentially an infinite healing island? I think it might be, right? You just come back here and, uh... And grab eggs. So wait, what is this fire over here? Oh shit, is this gonna go somewhere new? It is, isn't it? Oh god, that's that's a story. Oh, I don't wanna do the story yet. We'll do that later. I'll destroy the, the, the egg here. I'll destroy the egg, no, I'll destroy the boat here. On the edge of the lake. Alright. Oh, there's an item here. So what is this lakeside settlement? Have we been here yet? It's not ringing a bell, so let's take a look. Maybe we'll find some stuff. Careful here. It's auto-saving. Oh, we've been here. We've totally been here. We just didn't have a boat. But now we can investigate further. Okay. We were here much earlier, remember? Sadly, now there's more enemies. Of course there are. What a shocking twist. Thank you. Live well for a super chat. Let's do it. Let's see what we got. A gold bar? Probably a high value sellable item, right? Let's see, there's more treasures back here, apparently. Arkham's best is thank you. Congrats on 203,000 subs. Do I even have that? I didn't even notice. I'm, I guess I went up in subs. What a, what a shocker. With the nonsense of last week and people would sub to the channel to talk, right? Anyway. Um, there's nothing here. I guess we're going through here. Yep. Oh, yeah, yeah. We were here before. Yep. We went down. And there's a treasure at the end over here, apparently. I didn't find it earlier? I guess not. Red gemstone ring. I'm finding a lot of treasures. What is this? Old man's journal. Three years ago, my beloved daughter passed away shortly after giving birth to a son. Since then, the boy has grown considerably. He's a very curious child, and he has a true thirst for knowledge. He even tries to follow me when I go out hunting. I can't take my eyes off of him for a second. Whenever we walk in the forest, he always asks me to tell stories. He's fond of Don Quixote. Although he's still small, the boy's smart and observant beyond his years. If he weren't stuck here, he might have become a scholar. I was a careless fool. I could have sworn I shot clean through the wolf's head, yet it lunged at me. I was able to make it back to the cabin, but my wound is swollen and discolored, and I cannot bear seeing my boy's worried eyes. My body moves on its own, and I can hear voices inside my head. Am I going mad? I can die now. I can't die now. Leave the boy behind. Dear God, please protect him. So he got bit by an infected wolf, and he's turning into a Las Plagas, basically. So what happened to the boy? Huh. Thank you, Live Will, for that super chat. Let me get you on the leaderboard here. Thank you for that. Good opportunity to upgrade. Very good. Um, I guess we're going to keep investigating. This, again, we've been here already, but it looks like there's a lot of new treasures and stuff here. So that's cool. Take a look here. Yeah, look at all these treasures. 10,000. 
pretty darn good. 10,000 for that sucker. Nice. Okay, we go back now. Venom Sake, good evening. Good to see you, my friend. How are you? He turned into a trace from God of War. Oh. <laughs> Alright, oh shit. Oh, you stealth take down this fucker? Oh shit, 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 shit. Well. They heard him yell, but I don't think they know where I am. So there's a treasure over here. Oh, it's a way shrine. I can use this new way shrine key and see what it does. There's also a door with an insignia that I didn't open before. So maybe that'll lead somewhere. Hmm. Okay. So there's a way shrine right here. I don't think there's any enemies. Let's check it out. Will this key open this and what will we find inside? What the fuck is that? A pearl bangle? I still have the key. It's for selling only 12000 Ooh, I'm about to get a lot of good money. When I get back to that vendor, I'm going to make some money. Finally, hopefully, do some upgrades, which I've been waiting to upgrade my weapons for a while. I haven't really had the money to do it. Now it looks like I'll finally have the means to do it. Okay, so one other thing. is says the Insignia Gate. Did I already open that, though? Did I not already open the Insignia Gate and that's how I got out of here to begin with the first time? I guess not. I guess we're about to find out what's in here because I have no fucking clue. A side quest is locked in here. Look. Let's find out. Could someone catch the gigantic fish that lives in the lake for me? Fish oil has many uses after all. The photo can help you find it. How would I catch the fish? Sell a lunker bass. It's jump there's some kind of like a, a boathouse. So is that the boathouse we we're already at? It probably is, right? Saturday night bites, there you go. A reference to my old fishing stream. Um, I think that's the boathouse where we, we had already originally been. Uh, she says, maybe throw a harpoon. You may be right. Maybe you have to harpoon the bass and then you can catch it. What the hell do we have in here? What the hell? Oh no. Oh my god. What the hell's the... going on here? Exactly. What the fuck, dude? This was not in the original game. This is all new. What is this? What the fuck? This is oh, I gotta find out what's upstairs, dude. Ugh. Uh I received a tip, a dollar fifty two tip. Romance Resident Evil. What a... <laughs> what a tip. Thanks very much to the anonymous tipper. The first tip of the night. They want to romance Resident Evil. I mean... I don't know about what we just saw being very romantic. It's pretty disturbing and honestly scary. A dead body with carvings all over its face. Uh, yuck. But, nonetheless, thank you for the tip. It is the first tip of the night and I appreciate that. Alright. So this is all new stuff we're doing right now. This is actually quite exciting because it feels like I'm playing a new game right now. So what is up? The Forest Altar. What the fuck? 
I found a small key. That's good. That's a good find. Some gunpowder. Anything else over here? It seems to be a dead end. Huh. Maybe something later happens here. See this? That's disgusting. So they're catching and just murdering people for no fucking reason. Yeah, I think maybe we need a quest or something for this later. But I don't see anything else here right now. Before, oh, oh, oh never mind. Found a green herb. Oh, uh, let's combine. Cool. Uh, all right. Nice. We got a lot of healing. We got healing here. We got a snake to eat. We got more healing. We are, like, decked out with weapons right now and items. So we're pretty good right now. Um, but I have the feeling there's something here later, right? Doesn't it? Did you get the feeling there's something here? Why else would it be even named the Forest Altar? So probably later we come back for a quest. Okay. Uh, that was pretty disgusting. Not gonna lie. Pretty gruesome. Let's head back. So we did oh no! Oh, you're kidding me! Oh, shit. How many are there? Oh shit! There's a ton. Choke point. That was an instant kill. All right. Two down. Now there's the dogs. Jesus fuck. Oh no! Come on! Next. Jeez, I used almost all my ammo. Wow. That was a lot of enemies. Holy shit, man. That was a ton of ammo used. What am I supposed to do? I had to do it, right? Like, 
it's not like I had a choice. Well, I mean, I could get some more so... No, I can't. The only ammo I can do is handgun, and that's not even worth it because I have a bunch of handgun. So I'm just going to wait. Yikes. I mean, I guess I could heal myself by eating a snake. Eat the snake. Okay. Well, the good news is I've cleared the area. Fucking shit. The bad news is I wasted a lot of ammo. But now we can go sell a bunch of stuff, right? And by the way, infinite healing, remember? Where's the lake house? Right here? Where was the lake house where we got off? No, it was right here. The boathouse. So this is where the fish will be to catch. Let's get to the fucking boat right away. Get the fuck out of here. I don't want to fight nothing else. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Absolutely ridiculous. Okay, so, let's head across back to the chicken area, right? I want to get some chicken eggs to get full health. Money. All this money out here. I don't know if this randomly generates or not, this money. Or if uh, it's set spots, I'm not sure. Here's the chicken island. Let's go over there. Oh, is that a fish? There's a fish right there. That's not the right one, though. Perfect. Sweet. Sort of sorted. All right. We're going to see if we can catch that fish. We know it's at the boathouse from the picture. Oh, I received a tip, by the way. Hold on a second here, everyone. Let me take a look at the tip here. Thank you, whoever this was. A $5 tip came in from Jenny. Glad you're challenging this on Hardcore. Good challenging playthrough. Thank you for that, Jenny. I appreciate your support. You're the biggest tipper of the night. And uh, kind words as well. And yeah, it's fun. It's challenging as shit and scary and fun. So, it is all good. Thank you to Jenny for a $5 tip. That will get us up to $6 of to tips tonight. Thank you, thank you. Okay. We are going to be ordering some food for the React tomorrow, Dark Gallbach, but my wife and I are just going to determine what it is tonight, and we'll probably tell you what it is in the morning. We have no clue. We haven't really even talked about it. So the boathouse should be over here somewhere. There it is. And it showed the picture of the fish jumping right here. There it freaking is, right there. I got it! I got the Lunker! That's for the mission. <laughs> wow. Alright. Now we can go back. We can trade in several new missions with the with the guy. Right? Yeah, we could trade in a, quite a few. So there were two story places to go. I think what we'll do is we'll go to the merchant. We'll trade in what we have. Alright? And then we have a choice. We can try to go back here and see if there's something here. Which there very well might be. Uh, or we can go back to here. This is where the main story is. I guess we'll figure it out. Church? Wait, what? Church key? Why does it say church key there? Because we need two items to put in there to get the church key. That's what it is. So this is all new. None of this was in the original game. All this content is brand new, which is excellent. Uh, oh, I went too far. Shit, I missed the cave. At the, at the uh, emergency. Here we go. No, that's the wrong one. That's where the that's where the, the key is. We don't have the items for the key yet. I broke the fire thing. All right. Perhaps I'll be able to do some interesting upgrades. Raftalia is here tonight and says, I watched you play the Resident Evil 4 twice, your original run years ago and, you know, your more recent one last year. And glad to be here for the new one. I'm glad to have you here. Thank you. I have something I think you would welcome. I got something new for you. So, we have a lot to sell, correct? We have the Velvet Blue. We have the Gold Bar. 
We have the red gemstone ring. We have the pearl bangle, right? Now, why would I sell the insignia key unless there's no other use for it, right? Is he saying there's no other use? We've used it completely. Stranger. Also, the gold lunker bass and the golden chicken egg. A deal well struck. <laughs> nice. Well then, what can I do you for? So, we have nine. Oh my God! I totally wanted we ten. Like our herbs. Heal a man, kill a man. They do it all. <laughs> Reduces recoil and improves accuracy of the TMP. Man, this sounds like it would be good. It really does. Shit. Exactly, in the original game, spinels were the weakest thing to sell. and this, they're the most valuable because you get the rare items for them. Ugh, this is a tough choice. Do I sell the spinels for get a TMP stock, which could help a lot, right? Currently, we don't have any TMP, uh, we don't have any TMP ammo. That cash right? in your pocket. Oh, you okay, Mobster says yes. The game will only let you sell a key when it's useless. So you've used the insignia key fully. You can sell it. Business. Thank you, Mobster. Oh uh, man, should I buy the blueprints for these? I'm just gonna buy all the blueprints. Knowledge is power. I mean, it was a lot of money, but at least I can craft everything now, right? Um, do I want to upgrade anything? We have the new, the red handgun. Your weapons are in good hands, mate. So according I'll to this. The red is less accurate, but more damaging. See that? Way less accurate, though. So do I really want to deal with that? Ugh. Hmm. I have no idea what to upgrade. I really have no clue at this point. It's very... It's confusing. Like, what would be good? Right? Right? Get the laser sight first. Well, then I'm just going to save my spinels. I, I still don't have enough. The thing is, it's only good for the handgun. That's it. It's only good for the two handguns. There's some things money can't buy. I almost feel like the Punisher like, overall will be better because the Punisher is more accurate. And the Punisher you can put the scope on as well. So maybe you just don't need the Red 7, right? I might put the Red 7 into storage for now so that way I don't have two handguns. I don't think I need it. Let's take a let's take a look at um let's put away the red seven for now. Okay. And then what can I craft? I can craft four attachable mines. Explosives that can be attached with bolts with L3 while aiming the bolt thrower. They explode on a proximity. Hmm. Flash grenade, I need the better the better pieces, but you can make flash grenades. Those are very useful. Okay. I think I'll hold off. I think I won't craft anything. I'll keep the TMP on me, because if I find the ammo, I'll use it. But I think that's it. I think I'll save the spinels. And let's save now. So that was interesting side stuff we just did. Like, new stuff. Guys, if you're having a good time here tonight on the stream, if you could give it a like, I'd really appreciate it. We try to get 100 likes on all of my streams. Thank you in advance to anyone who does. And any other support is greatly appreciated as well. Thank you so much for your crowdfunding. I appreciate that. Um, so, we have a way shrine directly behind us. Well, that works out. Because I have a way shrine key now. We didn't used to have it, but now we do. There it is. Let's see what's in it. What in the heck is that? The butterfly lamp. That's a collectible. Now, three. I could put three red gems in it and sell it. Yup. Okay, I'm gonna go sell it. Let's do it. Let's go make some more money. By the way, any, anything else? If I backtrack here, there's a handgun ammo. If I backtrack way the fuck up, there's a few. I don't really want to backtrack all that way till I have to. We're going to have to go back to the church eventually anyway. So, all right. Cool. Uh, let's go back. We'll save it. and we'll, we'll sell at the merchant. We'll sell that. Then what we'll do is... uh. 
What is that? Hmm. We'll sell, and then we're going to head down here. This is the first item. Then I think you go up here, you get the second item. Once you get the two items, then I think you're going to go back here and you're going to use them to get the church key, and then you're going to go to the church. So that's all new what we're about to do. None of this was in the original game. So I have no clue what we're about to go up against here. Really well done, man. I The more I play it, the more I like it. I, it they did a great job. Oh, welcome. All right, let's do it. 21 grand, baby. Thank you. June. Very nice. Okay. Oh, man. All right, I am going to upgrade something. I'm going to upgrade the Punisher's power. tuned weapon can make this kind of work is about finesse. I'm going to do it again. Little bit goes a long way. And I'm going to upgrade the shotgun's power. Dazzled, are you? Our craftsmanship TMP, I'm not going to upgrade yet. And this gun is already upgraded once. It's quite good. Um, ammo capacity, reload speed, or rate of fire. Honestly, what I need is I need no, I need this, the laser sights. That's the only thing I care about is the damage and the accuracy. Moxer says if you could have found yellow or blue, it would have been more valuable. I don't care. I wanted to get these upgrades right now. I'll, I'll worry about that shit later. I'm sure there's going to be tons more in the game. So. Oh. The shotgun can only hold three. That's a kind of a problem. Apparently it's hold six. I thought it only held three. No, it holds six. Never mind. Ammo capacity is stupid. No, you don't need more ammo capacity. You don't, you don't need these, honestly. Maybe rate of fire. All right. This kind of work is about finesse, stranger. Little bit goes a long okay. way. Okay. So Punisher is like really nicely got maxed out, and we got a little bit of increased track. damage on the handgun. Let's say. Or the uh, shotgun. Excuse me. The handgun's gonna do really well now. All right. It is time. Do we have a key for this? I think we do now. Yes, we do. Another sellable. Sell it. <laughs> We're never going to get out of here. We're going to be doing this all night. We're never going to get out of the merchant area to do anything new. We're just going to be selling and upgrading all night. Hello, Welcome. Oh, my God. Ooh, all right, 8,000. Tune up. Struck. What are we tuning? <laughs> Do we want to max the knife or upgrade the knife power? See, I don't care about reload speed or ammo capacity. Nah, that's nothing. A well-tuned weapon can make up for a lack of skill. Five to seven, reload speed one to two. Load two rounds at a time. Mm. Do you, now, here's my question. I don't know if anyone can answer this. I have a, a tip to shout out regardless. In the meantime, if I upgrade the power of the combat knife, when I use it, for executions or down attacks or if something's on me and I stab with R2 does that increase the damage it deals there or is that always steady damage is it only going to increase the swipe damage if it only increases swipe damage then I probably don't want to do this but if it increases damage in all instances then I probably do want to do this um I received a five dollar and one cent tip from Chupa he says thank you for the content bra Thank you very much, Chupa, for a $5 tip. That is much appreciated. And you are now the top tipper of the night. Let's get that up on the leaderboard. Time is money, mate. You're telling me, bro. You're telling me time is money, huh? All right. Thank you guys. We're at $11 of tips now and climbing tonight. Stealth damage is an insta-kill. The damage is for slashing and stabbing. All right, forget it. Then I don't want to spend it. I don't, I'm not really actively slashing and stabbing that much. So I might just save the money. I'll save the money. We'll save it for later. Okay. So, good stuff. Now we're going to head to the first of two new, brand new areas to get the first of two items so we can go back and get that church key. So this is going to be... Let's find out. Thank you, El Grey Zoro, for that info, by the way. It's right over here. So we actually have to turn around and go southward. This way. The barrel. Now, wait a minute. Was that it? That was it. What's further down? Let's go down the whole way and see where this takes us. We haven't tried this yet.
Oh, crap. are we? We're at a way shrine. A way shrine we've never discovered before. Sounds good to me. What is that now? A splendid bangle. Oh boy. Yes. We can put these suckers in now. The emerald and the alexandrite. Look at that. It's going to be worth a ton. We sell this too. Might as well. <laughs> right? Jeez. We're making so much money. It's excellent. Anyway, that, were, that was... Wait, what? There's something else up there. I was so excited, I didn't fully investigate. What the hell is this? Another Alexandrite. Now, wait a minute. Hold on, hold on. Yeah! Duo bonus! It's worth even more. Wow! Alright, this is excellent. If you can't tell, I'm enjoying myself. The game is good. Very, very good. <clears throat> stonks? These are not stonks. These are rare gems and emeralds. It's, a, it's an expert's... Uh... Oh, shit. Look how long this river is. So this just takes you back out to the lake. But if we drive out there, do you think there's items along the way? There might be, right? Let's let's go for a ride, right? Let's see what's down there. Duh! Overpowered Boone. Didn't really enjoy zero punctuation from today's DSP Reacts uh, content, which I was kind of critical of, but I really don't get it. I, I don't really enjoy it. Maybe because I'm not British. I guess British people like them, which is fine. They're different strokes for different folks. Have a lot of facetas. Alright, well, that was it, huh? Just a bunch of pesetas. Well, you know what? Since we're out here, why don't we just go straight and do this one instead? Let's do it. Let's go straight across the lake. What's going on, Yoshino Lover? Good evening. Good to see ya. Fantastic Max thinks these are NFTs because it's basically digital items in a game. They're only good in the game. And therefore, they're they're uh, not really worth anything in the real world, but perhaps they're NFTs. And he's right. Would anyone like to buy a bracelet with two uh, gems in it? For real life money, contact me. <laughs> Jade, I believe everything from the from Resident Evil 4, the original, is in this game, plus new content. Because he's asking, is a particular person going to be in it? I would assume the answer is yes. <clears throat> Submachine gun ammo, that is music to my ears. Yes. Gunpowder and pasetas. So, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? <clears throat> Who are you? box in there. There's a ladder in there. But what the fuck is this? What am I supposed to do with this? Alright, I'm just gonna click something random. Ready? Apparently I got the first two right by complete randomness. Or I didn't. No. How the fuck am I supposed to know what this is? This... <laughs> uh... Are, okay, hold on a second. Are there three symbols that could fit together and would make sense? This one, this one, and this one. Fuck. Because they were all the same. They're all the same symbols, but that did not work. 
What about this one? No, I didn't even want that. I fucked. I didn't even want that. I fucked that up. What is this supposed to be? That's just their symbol. That's not even what it is. That's some asshole's bust or something. That has nothing to do with it. Right? This is just some fucking bones on the wall. There's no clue anywhere. You can't even give me a clue? Oh, shit. There's a clue. What the fuck is that? It's one of the symbols. They just gave me a raging clue. Raging clue number one right there on the wall. See that? By the way, I think I just received an insanely ginormous tip. Thank you if that is real. I will check that in a second. Here's a double, a triple snake dancing thing. The third one, I have no clue. But maybe I could just guess knowing the first two. I guess I'm just going to guess knowing the first two. Because I don't see a third anywhere. So one of them looked just like that. And one of them looked like the triple snakes. So the third one could be anything. Just try them all, right? No, nope, just keep trying them all. I, I got it randomly just by because I knew two of the three. Okay, that works. I'm sure it was out there somewhere. I just don't really care. <laughs> just being honest. It's, fuck it. Just trial and error until I fell the puzzle. If everything is, is fully loaded, everything's fully loaded that we can. What do we got? What is it? Oh, it's the hexagon piece we need for that other puzzle that we haven't solved yet. A blast from Femur's head. What the fuck? You ripped it off the body, dude. What are you doing? And blood came out. What the fuck? A bloody statue head. Here's the third. How are I supposed to see this? Huh? Oh, no. Oh, okay, I thought it was locked. It's not locked. Okay, good. How was I supposed to see these other symbols? Look. Now, wait a minute. Are they saying there's another puzzle? Is there a second puzzle? Because this one is the symbol with the thing under it. Okay. Yeah, there's a second puzzle. And this one is these three symbols together. Okay. So the three symbols together and the two with the one under it. I don't know what the third one is. I guess we could fuck around with it again until we figure it out, right? That's interesting. There's a, a second puzzle in the same exact spot. So the three together, and then the one with the thing under it. Wait a minute. I got a ruby. Sweet. We're getting a ton of shit here. By the way, I will shout out this tip. I swear to you I will. Just I'm kind of enthralled with the gameplay right now. So. Wait, we can't? It would have been. Oh, no. We did it already. It was this one, that one, and that one. Why were the answers upstairs? You couldn't see those until you'd already solved the puzzle. Why would the solution to the puzzle be upstairs past the door that's locked by the puzzle? I don't get it. Someone is saying you could climb from a different direction? What? Oh, shit! So I inadvertently solved the puzzle without having the solution to the puzzle. Ladies and gentlemen, whatever. Whatever works. And it worked. I got the item. Now we're going to go to the other area, right? But before we do, ladies and gentlemen, 
tonight on this very stream, I received an incredibly over the top, generous $100 tip. 100 smackaroos, 100 simoleons, 100 greenbacks. Thank you very much to an anonymous $100 tipper who says, Any puzzle bosses yet? Well, I mean, yes and no. A lot of the bosses in this game are kind of puzzle-like, where you need to kind of know how to beat them. And, of course, I don't know how that's going to work out, simply because they changed everything in the game around. So maybe there will be some things I solve and some things I won't know, right? And so, holy crap, thank you. For that so much let's get the gunner glasses on you guys are going to vote on a hat for tonight little crows here did a super chance at epic fail well thank you so much for that i really appreciate that <laughs> epic fail thanks so very much all right thank you so much the anonymous hundred dollar tipper you are awesome thank you so very 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 much um so what we'll probably do here is we'll split the part for tonight i'll do the poll people will start voting on the hat and we'll skedaddle over to the other area where we're going to get the second part for the key. Was that a fish? There was a fish there. <clears throat> Shoot, we could have caught the fish if I was in the boat. Okay. Thank you, guys. And uh, let's uh, split the part and continue. Thank you. If you're watching on YouTube, thank you so much. The on-demand videos have been getting great viewership, and I really appreciate that. I hope you're still enjoying the playthrough. Remember, liking the videos, leaving comments helps a ton. And uh, let's continue. <laughs> 